Hey guys, the thing that is on my mind this morning is how important it is to look at taking care of ourselves, our health, as a business strategy. And this works whether or not you're an entrepreneur or you're growing your career in a corporate setting. Um, I have really not done that for a couple of years and it kind of came full circle through COVID because I started noticing now I'm doing even less, right? So I wasn't really exercising regularly. I wasn't really watching what I was eating. In fact, I was doing an awful lot of snacking, if I'm honest. I gained about five or six pounds and just started just feeling sluggish and ugh, you know. So um, that's a technical term, by the way. Um, and so uh, 30 days ago, I decided I would do a 10 day challenge. And my 10 day challenge, it sounds, you know, um, very regimented, I guess it is. I would say I'll share mine, but do whatever works for you to help you feel better because it will make a huge difference in your business and your career. So for me, I decided no alcohol because I started noticing that I was having a glass of wine you know, every evening just to have it, not a special occasion, not because it went great with a meal, but because, no, well, that's just what I do. I'm locked down, I'm having some wine. Um, I wasn't drinking water. I wasn't exercising regularly. So here's been my routine for the last 10 days. No alcohol, um, two of these big guys of water a day. I've been doing, I've gotten up every day and done some kind of exercise, either an hour long walk or an hour long bike ride. I've missed a couple of days deliberately when I was super tired, but I would say I think I only missed two or three days in 30 days. I'll get back to that in a minute. And then I'm also doing foam rolling. So I'm doing that with Stacy Siegman. Um, she has a great program and it's given me a lot more core strength and I've noticed my waist getting smaller, which I also like. And she uh, focuses teaching in with it to really help you kind of connect inside as you're, you're moving through your day. So I love that piece. So that, oh, and meditating every morning. So it's a lot, right? But I have it written down, it's five, six things. And it has really helped me to focus, feel better about myself. And then I'm going to move this just a touch. And then it's, it's translated into my, my business. So I went 10 days, I decided to go another 10 days and now I'm at the very end of 30 days. And I can tell you after 30 days of really sticking to that, oh my gosh, I feel so much better. I feel lighter uh, physically and mentally. And I just, I find that I feel more confident. So, you know, I'm making the calls. I'm, I'm taking more action during the day because I, I feel good and confident to get that done. Um, and so I'm, I'm nearing the end of the 30 days. I will end up, you know, folding a glass of wine here and there back in, and I will be much more intentional about the way that I take care of myself. So if you're struggling to get a, um, a, some more progress in your business or in your career, maybe take a step back and think about your personal health and what couple of things can you do every day that are going to help you feel better mentally and physically and to help you take that forward into more power in your business. All right, guys, I hope you have a wonderful day and uh, it is like gorgeous out here. I'm going to go sit on the porch and work from outside because that's also part of what helps my mindset just be really, really clear and makes me happy. Talk to you guys later. Bye.